Hi everyone and welcome to Reading for Virgo. Did a quick shuffle and this is what's popped out. Okay, time to listen to your intuition, not rules and regulations that might be surrounding you. Your intu intuition knows what's right in a scenario that's really got you stuck and bound. You could literally feel trapped. This energy, it's very easy to get drawn in over a long period of time, small decisions, small things that happen around you and you end up, next thing you know, you're chained and bound to addictions or people with these issues. Could be going through getting guidance on the situation. Because you just want your happiness you don't want to have to be dealing with this any more you could literally be putting your foot down and seeing how negative energy radiates through your own life and people around you maybe you're making people accountable now or you're pulling yourself up that's massive huh. looks like a little fish in the cup like the page of cups Right at the front there. Intuition's leading the way. Rely on it. Even if it's a small little inkling. Okay? Because this energy seems to be following you around quite invasively at the moment. So I think basically also you have a choice. What, what do you want? Because it's in your hands. That negative energy could be coming from a fire sign, an earth sign, someone in power, or thinks they are. But the way to get over this also is to say no. Catch yourself, catch those thoughts. I saw the little birds up there, little tweet, 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 tweet. Catch those little negative thoughts. Be the master of your life again. Yeah, because particularly when you're in a fight or flight scenario, when things are really tough, when things, you know, you're really worried about money or your stability or you, you're having to defend yourself left, right and centre, it's it can be easy to end up getting drawn into one extra drink or negative mindset, negative relationships, overspending, excess of any kind. And the secret to finding your happiness is to not get drawn into too passionately into worrying about your money, poverty mindset. Oh my God, I'm never going to, I'm not going to be able to pay the next bills. And then drinking a heap or whatever it is, you know what I mean? That sort of energy to get over it because it's leaving you in a situation that's it's making it just get worse and worse you, you're in a state where you can't work or whatever you know what I mean or this is someone around you as I said this is someone you're dealing with here your manifest you've decided to manifest your way out of it you see it now it's the thoughts of the past that can draw you back down into a Feeling, get like you're stuck in a relation, you know, stuck back in the past. You need to be in the present. They say, you know, the past is history, the future's a mystery, the present is a gift. Present, it's the gift. So, yes, catch yourself as you start to think of all this stuff that's happened because it's just drawing you away from you finding your happiness now. 
people could be helping you, advising you. Keep an ear out for, you know, conversations you might hear as you wander by that might be of help to you. But also, um, if you do hear gossip, people talking or anything like that, so just take it with a grain of salt. You're doing you now. This flew out to the side. Yeah, getting the reins, knowing that you do have control over this and it's going to take just small, small steps to find that true happiness. Don't get in that poverty mindset and focusing on all the negativity of the past and do not listen to, to chatter. Don't get caught in thoughts of past, as I said. Keeps on coming up. Because the way to truly get control of this scenario and find the wisdom in it to balance out the devil side of us and the more intuitive side of us is to take the reins. Okay. This energy doesn't have any power over you. Time to put it in its place, whether it's a person, place, or thing. All right. Well, let's see if there's any love blocks. Thank you. Visualize, be clear about what you want. Yes. Don't get caught and think things of the past, things that have happened, things that have ma made you feel like you're in a lax state, you're stuck, it, it's all gone bad, okay? Visualise what you want, think of the future and the present. What what are you aiming for? Okay? You're aiming for this, to be able to manifest your ultimate happiness or you're constantly going over this and remaining there. You can do it. Target, aim, shoot, fire. <laughs> I really hope that helped. I love you all and bye for now.